you are tuned into how to find the right entertainer in indianapolis radio i have a secret to tell you with your host superstar event planner tiffany you will go hello it's tiffany your superstar event planner here to give you advice tricks and tips on everything entertainment in the Indianapolis and surrounding areas. I'm so excited because it is 2020 and we've been waiting for a long time for this year, 2020. So I'm really, really excited about it. I hope that you are too. We're gonna make some amazing, unforgettable, and memorable moments when it comes to planning any type of event, small or large. Um, so before we get started and I ask you that famous question or ask your famous question, there is a spot that I think you guys should all know about. I did a little research and the reviews are super amazing. Um, if you're looking for some family entertainment outside the home, um, for kids especially, there's a place called Ninja Zone and it's on Lake Ridge Drive in Fishers. Um, it has tons of ninja games. Everyone loves games. So if you um, have some time, um, especially on the weekends, think about using that, utilizing that family time and going to Ninja Zone at 11464 Lake Ridge Drive, Fishers, Indiana 46037. And make sure when you go and you have a good time, let me know how you enjoyed it. Um, but before we get started with our amazing topic or subject, I'm going to ask you a question and it's in refer to birthday parties. What type of ideas or what type of ideas have you thought of or have you even thought of what kind of ideas you could have be done during a child's birthday party ages 6 to 12? Are there any birthday party ideas that you haven't thought of? Well, I've got five that I want to talk to you guys about and um, Basically, I have five birthday party ideas for children ages 6 to 12 that will save you not only time, but money. And so I'm going to answer all those questions when we come. Let me guess. They put you in charge of the next event. You remember the epic fail from last year event and you're having a hard time coming up with something new. Well, no one said it'd be easy planning your next event, especially when you watch the same old thing every year. It's about time to bring in something fresh, new, and something exciting to make that shift in your next event. You can choose from so many because M Entertainment Agency Indy, Indianapolis, Indiana is definitely your one-stop shop. Create your budget and what you would like, and we can provide you with everything you need. From DJ services, face painting, comedy magic, and even comedians. There's a reason why our clients continue to come back to us. We provide the perfect talent, and they are always pleased. I know you're going to dig this. How to find the right entertainer for your Indianapolis, Indiana event show with Tiffany. We now return to your regular programming. Okay, we are back. And before we left, I asked you if you had any ideas, different birthday party ideas for children. Have you ever thought of anything out of the ordinary or out of the box? And I definitely have for you today five birthday party ideas for children ages 6 through 12 that will save you time and money. When I was growing up, you know, birthday parties was not a huge thing, um, but they loved to gather, especially the friends in the neighborhood. So on our birthdays, you know, we did a lot of playing outside. Um, if my mother had a party for one of us growing up, it was people just kind of sitting around. No one was doing anything. There were no games. Um, I was a confused child at the time. I'm like, isn't this supposed to be a party? Uh, but I guess that was her way. But obviously times have changed, and I've got five party ideas that are out of the box, and they're going to save you time and money. The first one is a uh, the circus magic party. So basically, you want to theme this as a circus. 
and some people might think you have to go all out and do all these crazy extravagant purchases to, you know, elephants to lions and that's not true. Um, the money saving part of this is limiting your guest list. So um, don't invite the whole uh, daycare <laughs> or school um, because that will increase how much you pay for this type of party and this is supposed to be something fun but it's supposed to also save you some money so the first cost cut would be to you know limit your guest list to about 10 to 11 um, you decorate the area that you're using with circus items you can get a lot of that stuff from party city or even um, Dollar Tree, Dollar General, those places tend to have, oh and Five Below, they tend to have a lot of different party favors and, and uh, things to dress up your party if you're theming it. Those places usually have what you need. So um, with the food, you know, what do we always eat at a fair? When we go to a fair or a circus, it's always hot dogs. So you can prepare hot dogs. Also popcorn, peanut boxes, cookies and cakes and so you got all that going on but then the magician comes to perform uses the birthday child as the guest on his stage and so the kids are having this great time at the circus with all these different types of foods and snacks um, with games but then you tap it off with the magician so the circus magic party that is the first one that is an out of box out of the box idea for birthday parties for ages 6 through 12. The second one is summer camp fun party. So if you don't have to be into camping, but how this works is you have the limited guests, I would say limit the guest list for something like this to about 10, maybe between 8 and 10, that would probably be even better. So you're not buying a whole bunch of dinner because the um, fun camp usually will happen at night, so you get to camp up at night. Make sure they bring their sleeping bags, their pillows, and their blankets. And to tap it all off, you can add a magician or a face painter um, to the end of the night. So you're not having to worry about a whole bunch of dinner because the event starts later. So that's one good saving point. Your limit, save money saving point. You're limiting your. Um, kids the guest list because you're limiting that that means you can you're saving money because you're not buying as much for more kids and then um, of course having activities around but the highlight of it all will have a magician or face painter come in and then in the night off right so that was number two the, the summer camp fun party the third one is the sweet party, and these are super fun because there are so many different hotels now that cater to just, you know, sweets only. So we'll use an example of a Staybridge suite. What you can do is you have the kids come. It's kind of like a slumber party, but it's in, a, it's in the suite of either Staybridge, Embassy Suites, Town Place Suites. There's so many of them out there. You can just kind of make your choice. Um, and then you have a face painter come in towards the end to paint their faces. So they've had all this fun in a hotel room that's a suite and they're dancing and having a good time. But then the face painter comes in and um, paints the faces of the children and, and they leave. That is an absolute perfect party, <laughs> the sweet party. The fourth one would be the pajama jam party. So this can be done at home. You don't have to go to any type of venue for this. The money saver, the money saver happens because this event is overnight. So it's not like you're out buying a bunch of stuff. You have about eight to ten kids in your home or your apartment. Make sure um, they have pajamas, special pajamas for that evening. Um, and then also you can bring in a face painter uh, during this before they actually go to sleep you can bring in a face painter to paint the faces of the kids and um, there you have it pajama jam party everyone's got their best pajamas on and you can do little contests things like that uh, vote who's uh, best pajamas or vote best PJs so the pajama jam party and the last one is an ice cream birthday party 
So everyone loves ice cream and we love cake too, but how fun would it be if you had a um, ice cream bar for the kids to kind of dress up and make their own sundaes and um, it's almost like going into Baskin Robbins or something like that, seeing all these millions of flavors that you can choose from. So I would get about 10 different flavors and just let them have a ball. So let's go back and review. The Circus Magic Party, the Summer Fun Camp Party, the Sweet Party, the Pajama Jam Party, and the Ice Cream Birthday Party. All five are out of the box. All five can be done and all five is definitely going to save you time and money. So I am about to be out of here. I hope you guys enjoyed this uh, podcast. And remember, if you want your next event to be unforgettable and memorable, you must get the right entertainment. Until next time, everybody. Get the answers from Tiffany on how to find the right entertainer radio with Tiffany. Thank you for tuning in to how to find the right entertainer for your event radio.